This is Patty. You know what today is? It's the Haywood County, North Carolina Studio Art Tour. So Mom's Weird Art said, hey, we better go check this out. Meet some wonderful artists, explore the different towns. So why don't you come along and I'll see you there. Bye. Becky, what is the name of your shop? Old Brick House, but hidden inside the Old Brick House, we have the Spice and Tea Pantry in the back. And so it's completely different vibe back there with over a hundred different loose leaf teas, over a hundred different spices and blends and salt, peppers and paprikas. And we just recently added in olive oils and vinegars. Wonderful. Mm. So it's very different than the main part of the shop that's yes. been here. We are on our 20th year now. Boy, it's such a charming town. I love Waynesville. Oh, I love Waynesville. Oh, it is. Now, what made you decide to get into the spice and the teas? And well, whenever we first started off back in 2003, we were a furniture store. But then 2008 came and we sold, or we still do sell, very high quality heirloom level furniture that's crafted by the Amish in Pennsylvania. So we still have that as part of our line, but people weren't affording those pieces of furniture at that point in time in 2008 or so. So we needed something that was going to kind of meet people and bring them in on a regular basis. And so we developed the idea of the pantry and it took two years to put it together. And um, it has been going strong ever since. Wonderful. And it just smells fabulous in here. Grateful. <laughs> <laughs> and this must be your- This is my husband, Charlie. Hey there, Charlie. Hi. Hi. <laughs> so you are a great team here together. And wow. Vienna is the one that oh, at this who stocks point all this? Is, she does? Yes, she does oh. all of this bag filling and she is preparing for a few days off. And so she's like packing things up as much as she can. Here uh -huh. she is. Hey Hi. there, you are a busy lady. You're gonna need some time off, aren't you? Well, I am. <laughs> well we joke that she retired. It's been what? I six did. Years I ago? retired. I stayed home for two weeks, cleaned out closets, and I called Becky and I'm like, okay, I've had enough of this. <laughs> I'm coming back home <laughs> to here. I need to come back to work. Your second home. Yes. <laughs> well, you have to be. I can tell. I don't know you. My first time I've met you, but you must be very organized, both of you ladies. I try. <laughs> yes, to keep all this together. We try. The tea that really augments, um, makes your dreams more vivid. Really? Because we have answers within our subconscious that it's hard to lay hold of sometimes. And so by using that tea, you just have a drink of tea. Make sure you have paper and pencil beside of you whenever you lay down. <clears throat> and whether you're doing a meditation or whether you truly do fall asleep, your subconscious helps surface and bring answers. So you need to scribble your answers down real quick and then go back to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> All right, show us that tea once again. Everybody's gonna wanna order that. <laughs> that is the Dreamin' Tea. Dreamin' Tea, okay. And I believe in holistic, you know, things, remedies for all sorts of things, and you have this here in teas. Yes. Definitely, and what was the other one for nighttime? Um, Peaceful is another nighttime tea, and that one has rosebud in it, so you've got that nice, floral, gentle, tuck you in, oh. wrap you up in a cozy blanket kind of a feeling. <laughs> <laughs> Pleasant dreams, everyone. Yes. <laughs> Get your tea and <laughs> dream on, dream on. <laughs> Our next stop in the Haywood County Studio Art Tour, we are in Canton, North Carolina. Very charming little downtown with a lot of great artists, little dining spots. 
Watch as we meet Hannah the Potterer. Wow, hello. Hi, how are you? Wonderful. My name is Patty, and I am doing a YouTube channel called Mom's Weird Art, featuring artists and their studios in charming towns. Ah, well, so you picked a good day to do it. I know. <laughs> <laughs> and what is your name? I'm Hannah. Hannah, mm -hmm. great. And you're doing? I'm doing some pottery today. Awesome. I'm building a big piece out of sections. Oh, okay. So what I'm is... going to take this one and flip it over and attach it to that one. Wonderful. Yeah. Yes. Do you do classes as well? We do classes and we do um, all kinds of workshops. Fantastic. How long have you been here? We've been here about a year. Well, you've yeah. got a great studio yeah. Thank here. You. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Been fun. Yes. Let's, and this is some of your finished pieces? Yes. Yep. All right, let's see what we got. All right. Oh, cute little pumpkins. These pumpkins are from a recent workshop we did. Just waiting to be picked up. Now, is this a family affair? You and your husband? Uh, it's just me. Just you? Yep. All right. And now, Kim, what is this used for right here? It's a kick wheel. It used to have a tabletop and a seat, but it got destroyed with some water damage. So process of restoring it. Okay. Yep. But you just pick it. It doesn't use any electronic. All so manual, just, huh? Just keep spinning. Yeah. Now is it a little more difficult to use than? Um, I mean, it's definitely a leg workout. <laughs> um, yeah. But old fashioned. Some people just really like the old fashioned way. Yes. Mm -hmm. Very, very nice. This is great. And this is definitely harder. I took a pottery class one time. It's very difficult. It is, yeah. It yeah. took me a while to learn. I had to take the class twice. Just be like, okay, I'm ready. <laughs> now, what do I do next? <laughs> Teach me the things. Did you go to an art Votech school? No. or No, I you did just... a continuing education class at the local community college. Here in, um, in Camp... Asheville, yeah. Oh, AB Tech, yeah. AB Tech, yeah. They're a wonderful school, yeah. yeah. They offer so many great programs. Yeah. Mm hmm. Fabulous. All right. Well, I don't want to interrupt you. You're fine. Yeah. Thank you so much for taking the time and showing us. Enjoy the rest of the afternoon. You as well. I did video all of those. Oh, okay. Do oh, you have a studio in the back? I do have a studio in the back. Take a peek. Okay, it's um like the perfect storm back here. It's part <laughs> back room An to artist the store <laughs> and part pottery studio. So. Pottery and process. Yes. I love it. Yes. So <laughs> come through this obstacle okay. course. Watch your step. There's a little bitty step down right here that will trip you up. All right. Okay. So pardon the naked lady. <laughs> So here's where the magic happens. Okay. And it's clean for once. Normally it is a mess, but I cleaned it up, getting ready for my next run of things. I have some different pieces up here that I like to create. I have some peace oh, sign, Christmas cool. ornaments, and some little vases. Wonderful. And then I have a slab roller I love to hand build as well as throw on the wheel. It just keeps me in different phases throughout the day. Um, well, now, I how does that come, work? This rolls the clay out flat and it measures like whatever thickness you would like. It just rolls a sheet out flat for you to create with. You can add the pieces together and create all sorts of funky things. Um, I usually start early in the morning before the store opens and I'm working back here. And once things are dry, I take them downstairs to get fired in the kiln. Oh, and you even so, have your own kiln here. Yes, wow. I do. Mm -hmm. I have three downstairs. 
Wonderful. So. And do you have any assistance, or is this just strictly this is me? You? <laughs> do you ever so, give classes? Or I do not. But the Cold Mountain Art Collective, she is really set up well. Yes, I met to her do over that. There. Yes. yes, Hannah mm -hmm. will hook you right up. Yes, wonderful. With classes, so. Well, thank you so yeah. much. Hey everyone, follow me as we take beautiful Western Carolina back roads to meet with a very special artist, Molly Harrington Weaver, as she shows us her beautiful work from her gorgeous setting, a farm with her own stables and horses. Hello, <laughs> I am Patty. I am so happy to be here in your studio tour. What is your name? I'm Molly Harrington Weaver. And you are the artist, yes, Molly? Thank How long have you been doing art? Oh my word, how long have I been doing art? As long as I've been alive, <laughs> <laughs> but not professionally. So I started when I was like three years old in my little room, huh. um, but then kind of got away from it a long, long time. Um, I became a doctor, I'm a pediatrician. You're a pediatrician. Three days a week. <laughs> <laughs> so, but my Just... art, yeah, my art is my happy place and my therapy ah. and yeah. That is super impressive. Thank you. Oh my goodness, yes. yes. So I, you must be the first artist, a pediatrician. I don't know. I just, you know, the art hangs in a, my office, actually. The kids can see my animals. And, yes. Um, sure, yeah. That is so, fabulous. Yeah. Uh, do you have one here in particular that has a story or some special meaning to you that you'd like oh, to? Oh, that's a, okay, a story. Let's think, let me think. You think well, I'm just going to go okay. ahead and video some of your beautiful work here? <laughs> Are you? Do you like to horseback ride? Oh, I love horses. Uh, I have some real ones back there. Oh, and this, this scene was actually a uh, picture taken right back here. Oh, yeah. wonderful, yeah. Montana. Montana, and beautiful. Curly the sheep. Oh, um, he I love was Curly. One of my very early works, oh. and he just is a bestseller. So this is a print. Oh. But uh, he's all around town in places. <laughs> Doesn't he make you want to smile? <laughs> oh, and, and now that's photography. That's a photograph. Of the yes. Early morning research farm here. Right here on your right property? Here. Well, no, down the road a little bit. Oh, okay. Down a little bit. Okay. And. I don't know how much you want to hear about everything, but this is a red wolf. Oh, I beautiful. did for a red wolf conservation fundraiser. Fantastic. Yeah, Colors, everything, else. the detail, and now what is the cow? What are we naming the cow? Uh, here's looking at Moo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. fantastic! Yes, that's just the Haywood County cow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. oh, oh, look at this! You make me smile. Look at how colorful, beautiful colors. I love it. Thank you. Did you recently do this one, or has no, this been? He's been well too. He's a, uh, yeah. Oh, I love the out in the woods. And that's into the woods. Oh, yep. beautiful coloring. Fantastic. Keep filming. <laughs> <laughs> so this scene is down the road a little bit. Oh. And the golden rod blooms. And and I love Two this. cows in a pod. <laughs> <laughs> that is wonderful. The expression, you're just fabulous how you're capturing the, oh, well, I have to, amazing. My, I guess I'd say my main story would go way back to our dog, Moses. And I did him first, oh. 10 years ago, the drawing. And uh, I was like, wow, I just drew our dog, you know, right here. <laughs> Yes. For what I did a long time ago, the drawing. But then I painted him. Oh. So that's Moses. Moses, <laughs> look at you. He's no longer with Aww. us. <laughs> but now he can be right. And now he's here every day. Aww. Yeah, that's him too. But that got me started. Our beautiful Great Pyrenees was my muse, I guess you would say. Boy, and look so, at. And then that's a request. That was a custom portrait mm. for somebody. Fabulous. Really, really nice. And then this, you have your real horse back here. Somewhere you have a barn. <laughs> you want to 
I'll get you and in. Want me to go over here? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and I would like to meet you yeah, at Cheerio at your better. <laughs> well, they usually hang out. What a fabulous backyard you Hi. have. Your babies. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Come here. They're gonna think I have food. Come on. No. That's uh, Jake. Oh, He's great. Is this Jake coming Jake's towards coming us? Out. Jake's very friendly. Oh, very look at friendly. Jake. Hi, Jake. <laughs> Say, who's horrible. this lady? And this is the. This is our one lady horse, Happy. Kathy? Happy. Happy. She's a, a halflinger oh, breed. Okay. <laughs> Can you pet? I'd like to get a close sure. up of you petting the. Sure. Oh, look at how hey, buddy. beautiful. You be on the oh. Yes. Yeah, I'm a very oh. friendly guy. Oh. Hey, buddy. Beautiful. Oh. <laughs> Wow, this is fantastic. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's like, where's my treat, Mom? Oh, yeah, where's my like, treat? They're very food. All right, you're going to come around too, huh? He's up safe, you got <laughs> So this belongs to our neighbor, we share. And oh, this, share. But this is my horse. <laughs> got birds in her hair. <laughs> hey, baby. He's like, where's my treat? <laughs> I'm very Beautiful. What a great home they have to <laughs> run and ride and beautiful. There's two more, but I don't know. Oh, you have two more. <laughs> That's your, t and then you share that with the neighbor. Well, the neighbor, we have two that belong to the neighbor. One belongs to me, and one belongs to a camp nearby. Oh, okay. And I help we. Take, help each other with our horses. So, yeah. Great. Yeah. Oh, they're just absolutely beautiful, aren't they? Mm. I have to do a painting of you. Are you having fun? Oh, beautiful. <laughs> that beautiful photograph, too. Oh, oh gosh. Sweet. Which oh, I can do funny. with this. Oh! <laughs> oh, you yeah. have it made here. I'll tell you what. Thank you. I Yes. Now, how do you have the time to do your artwork with being a pediatrician, taking care of the horses? Oh and so how, that's a good question. Um, how do I have time? Yeah. Mm, well, I make time. <laughs> um, When's gosh. your creative time of the day? Well, that's a very good question. <laughs> My time, I would say it's nighttime. So what happens, because we have three girls, they've all pretty grown, two are driving. So everyone goes to bed. And then I'm like, ah, oh, that's mom's time. Everyone's asleep. And then I can just relax and I'll go to my place and I'll paint. And yeah, it's nighttime. Wonderful. And there, if I really get into it, I lose track of time um, and I'll just be really tired <laughs> the next day. <laughs> but, but, but knowing it was worth it. <laughs> yeah, it, it's really, I guess it is, it's nighttime. <laughs> I kind of wish it wasn't, but, it, but that's just what it is. So. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, yeah. wonderful. God, so. God. great. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you so much for sharing your story. Thanks for, yeah. Your you artwork is fantastic. Thank it really so is. Thank you. I feel very, very blessed to live here. And yes, you are. Beautiful beauty around me everywhere. What a special place very this inspiring. is. <laughs> <laughs> now, do so. you have a website where people can go to buy your yeah, art? I do. So you go to artbymolly.com with an IE. Molly. Art by Molly, M O L L I E dot com. And that's also my Instagram. Perfect. I'll Art tag Molly. that as well. Wow, you know, if you're looking for a picturesque small town charm with lots of art, great shopping and dining, and just a small hometown feel, Haywood County, Waynesville, Canton, Clyde, such a beautiful, beautiful area. And I'm so happy I was able to meet such great people. Had such a wonderful time and I'll definitely come back. And I suggest you check it out as well. Okay, that's it. Bye. <laughs>